أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم وإذا سألك عبادي عني When my servants ask you about me فإني قريب Indeed I am near أجيب دعوة الداعي إذا دعان I answer the one who calls on to me when he or she calls on to me. فَلْيَسْتَجِيبُوا لِي So let them answer my invitation by calling on to me. وَلْيُؤْمِنُوا بِي And let them believe in me. لَعَلَّهُمْ يَرْشُدُونَ So that they may receive clarity and guidance. My brothers and my sisters, this is the month of Ramadan. It's the month of dua. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in Surah Al-A'raf, اُدْعُوا رَبَّكُمْ Call on to your Lord. With hope, with longing, in private, alone, when no one else is looking. For he does not like those who transgress. Which means the one who does not make dua transgresses. Because when you turn to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and make dua, you're saying, Ya Allah, on my own I can't. But through you, I can. And when you don't do dua, you're saying the opposite. It's almost arrogant. To assume that on your own, subhanAllah, you're able to navigate the difficulties and the challenges of dunya. So to humble yourself and to call on to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is one of the ways of expressing your Islam to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, your submission in Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala describes Zakariya and his wife and how Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala beautified and blessed their marriage. And he says, وَأَصْلَحْنَا لَهُ زَوْجَهُ إِنَّهُمْ كَانُوا And we rectified their marriage because they used to, what did they used to do? كانوا يسارعون في الخيرات. They used to compete with one another in doing good. So dua is important, but couple it with action. ويدعوننا and they used to call on to us. رغبا رغبا ورهبا with hope, knowing that Allah can, and with fear, admiring and being in awe of Allah سبحانه وتعالى's immense power and capacity. وكانوا لنا خاشعين and they remained humble. And the way that Allah describes the word khushu'ah, humility in the Qur'an, وَتَرَ الْأَرْضَ خَاشِعَةً Imagine two mountains, standing tall and strong. When the water comes, the mountain doesn't absorb any of the water. But the mountain serves as a slope, allowing that water to collect in the middle of that valley. Allah calls that valley al-ard al-khashi'ah, the humble ground. So let us join one another in this, in this series, inshaAllah, through which we explore the dua from the Qur'an and the sunnah.